Welcome to Maso Tech Tips. In today's video, we'll show you how to load or update software on your Maso G3 and G3 Touch. Let's get started. When you power on your Maso, you'll see either a welcome screen or the control screen. Either way, the process to install or update your software is the same no matter what screen you're on. First, head over to my workshop and download the correct software for your machine. If you have a lathe, download the lathe software. For other machines, choose multi-head. Place the downloaded file into a folder called Maso on a branded flash drive. Be sure to use a FAT32 formatted drive with the MBR file system, as GPT is not supported on Maso. Now we're ready to load the software. Turn on your Maso and start tapping the screen immediately to boot into the software load screen. If you haven't already, insert your flash drive. You'll see the files appear on the screen. Simply select the file you want and press Enter. Once the software is loaded successfully, press Escape to complete the process. Maso will automatically restart with your new software. Now, if you're updating software, always make a backup first. Go to the F1 screen, enter your password, and select Save and Load Settings. Click Save to File to back up your settings. There's also a Save Printable File option, which lets you save a printable version to double-check your settings after the update. Trust me, this will save you hours of troubleshooting later. And that's it! Loading or updating software on your Maso is simple, and with a backup, you're always safe. If you found this video helpful, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss our next tips. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.